Hi, this is Morgan from Sherwood Dodge and I'm gonna show you this 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee. Here is the 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited X in bright white. So this 4x4 SUV has a remote start engine, titanium accents throughout, adjustable roof rails, a sports performance hood, and premium LED headlights. In the front, it is a part of the advanced safety group, so it does have the front parking sensors for the park assist, so that's what those dots right there are for, as well as the main sensor right there for the safety features. So we'll go take a look under the hood. Under the hood, it has a 5.7 liter V8 Hemi VVT MDS engine, powering an eight speed automatic transmission. So what that MDS does is it shuts off four of the eight cylinders when going at a consistent highway speed to increase your fuel efficiency. Moving down this Limited, it does come with the QuadraTrack 2 four wheel drive system. So that gives you extreme traction control even at low speeds because it can distribute all of the available torque to the axle with the most traction. It also comes with auto rear leveling suspension. In the back, it does come prepped and ready with a receiving hitch and wiring. So that hitch and wiring is just underneath the cover right there. It also has a backup camera with rear park assist as well as rear parking sensors. So those sensors again are those white dots right there. It also has a power lift gate, so if you hit the button on the remote twice, it will open nicely for you. There is lots of room in the trunk as well. It does have that cargo shade cover, so to close it, you can hit the same button on the remote twice. And there also is this button inside. This Grand Cherokee also comes equipped with blind spot and cross path detection warning. So the triangle on these side mirrors will illuminate if there's a vehicle in your blind spot and chime if you turn your signal light on. So we'll go take a look at the features inside. Inside this Limited X, it does come equipped with Bluetooth. So you have your Bluetooth command buttons right there, the buttons that control what you see on the dash, as well as the adaptive cruise controls. So you set the speed and the distance and the vehicle automatically work to maintain that with minimal braking. And in high traffic areas, it will come to a complete stop without driver assistance as well. So this is the driver assist screen on the dash. This is where most of the safety features will be displayed, such as the distance that you set with your adaptive cruise control, as well as the full speed forward collision warning. So if the Jeep notices you're approaching another vehicle or an object too fast, it will let you know and apply braking if needed. That icon right there is your lane departure warning. So if you do veer out of lane without signal, it will notify you and apply, apply corrective action if needed. It has an 8.4 inch Uconnect touchscreen display, fully equipped with Sirius XM and a premium Alpine speaker system. You can also connect your phone via aux, USB, or Bluetooth streaming. It does have dual climate control, and the seats in the front are heated with two preset temperature settings. There also is a heated steering wheel. It does have navigation, so you can preset your home and work address. And it does have Apple CarPlay and Android Audio, so you can pair your phone and go hands-free with Siri. Under the app page is where you'll find the emergency SOS button, and this Jeep does come equipped with Wi-Fi hotspot. It does also have the off-roading pages here, so it's where you can track the dynamics, the pitch roll, and the select train system when you are off-roading. There also is a backup camera, so whenever the Jeep is in reverse, it will automatically appear on the screen. It does have that rear park assist, so those lines will nicely guide you into any stall, letting you know if you're getting too close to any vehicle or object. When in reverse, this will also automatically appear on the dash. These are the front and rear parking sensors. So if you're getting close to any of them, they will light up and chime for you. It does also have the stop feature, so it will automatically stop the vehicle if you do get too close. Moving down, you have the quick action AC and heat controls, as well as the option to turn off the parking sensors and the lane departure warning. This button right there is the parallel park assist. So if you hit that button, shift the vehicle into drive, it will park itself into a suitable stall or merely just guide you. In this nook here is where you'll find the aux and USB ports. It does have that select train system, so you can pick the road condition or you can let auto do its work by auto adjusting the dynamics of the vehicle to match the road condition. The seating in here is leather. Again, these front seats are heated and it does come with a dual pane panoramic sunroof. So we'll go take a look in the back seat. In the back, there is lots of room between the first and the second row. Those leather seats do continue and it does get lots of light with that sunroof. Hi, thanks for watching. If you have any questions on this limited, please feel free to give us a call. We'd love to hear from you.